This is Chris Paul from the TJMS running through the top stories in roughly 60 seconds with the Morning Minute. Donald Trump is holding off on the recent tariffs he threatened China with. The stock market has been in a free fall in anticipation of these tariffs, but upon yesterday's announcement, the stock market soared. Hey, what if the president was purposely throwing out extreme trade policies just so stocks would tank and then all his rich buddies could buy a whole bunch of stocks real cheap and then immediately reap huge profits once he reverses that policy? That would be crazy, right? Attorney General Bill Barr, a.k.a. Justice Department Jabba the Hutt, made a call to the prison that let Jeffrey Epstein kill himself. First, the warden was reassigned, though most likely he was promoted. And the two prison guards in charge of watching Epstein have been put on administrative leave. Why weren't they fired? This happened right in front of them and they completely missed it. They don't belong working in a prison. They should be NFL referees. More and more men are pampering themselves. The International Spa Association says the United States spent $18.3 billion in spa visits last year. And men make up 49% of the spa visits, up from 27% a decade ago. Experts say it's because men are now more conscious about their health and well-being, and they embrace the healing elements of a spa visit. But I say more men are visiting the spa because of two words, Robert Kraft. I'm Chris Paul. Memphis, catch me and Huggy Lowdown Thursday through Sunday night at Chuckles Comedy House. And this was the Morning Minute.